Hello there, I'm Big Alias. This is another unexpected Call of Duty video. Um, but Black Ops 6, a game that I reported on, the, the reveal of recently, um, they've actually put out a one minute long teaser. And, uh, you know, I'm eking out all of, the, all of the news. I'm following the news and posting it to the channel with my own British spin and my own British take on things. Um, and it's odd because, to be honest with you, I'm, I'm not like massively excited for the game, uh, but it's just fun following it. However, I will say, following this teaser, I'm now a lot more excited because this was freaking great. This was a great teaser trailer. I'm not sure whether I'll be able to put it in the video. Um, I guess it all depends on whether I'm willing to take that risk. Um, but if I do, uh, I'll maybe screen cap a closed caption version of it so that you can see what they're saying, but I'm certainly not going to include the audio. Um, it's just a one minute long teaser. It's black and white. It's moody and gloomy and it's freaking awesome. And I love it so much. Basically, it's a bunch of um, very influential political figures uh, talking but it's so mysterious um, and they've got like, it's in black and white, you know, like I said, but it's, they've got like the cigarette smoke, you know, hanging in the air. They're saying very conspiratorial stuff. It's got freaking Saddam Hussein in the trailer, which is bizarre. It's also got Margaret Thatcher. I really hope they're not going to paint her in a good light. Um, I hope that, you know, uh, bad things happen to her. I'm not, I'm not a particular not a Thatcher fan, um, but it's interesting to see her in a video that's uh, like, you know, wrapped up in darkness and conspiratorial stuff. So I don't think they are going to. And there's George Bush, who I, I think it's senior, right? Um, I mean, there have been claims that you, you're going to have like a mission set in uh, during 9-11. I think this is kind of heightened that theory. Uh, this honestly could happen, which is so bizarre to me. Um, it's so interesting that this game, you know, all of these Black Ops games, with well, the exception of a couple, have been set like in these sort of past eras. We had the Cold War stuff. Well, we had the um, Vietnam stuff. We had the 80s Cold War stuff. And now we've got 90s, maybe even early 2000s. It's going to be so weird playing uh, one of these games during an era that I was alive during. And honestly, potentially skirting into areas that I was honestly quite nostalgic for. Um, so that's going to be... That's going to be very interesting. But yes, the trailer is exactly what I wanted it to be. This looks very Black Ops 1 coded um, in that, you know, it's very political. And I mean, actually political, not, oh, there's a female. Um, no, it's a, it, it looks like a very political game, very wrapped in its like dark conspiracy theory stuff. And it is exactly what I want from a Black Ops game. So I've gone from, oh, I don't know, do I really care to, okay, actually, you know what? I hate you, Call of Duty, but you've got me again. You freaking got me again, dude, because, uh, yeah, I'm actually kind of looking forward to this. Um, this... This, this teaser was absolutely badass. And if they carry on in this in this tone, then we could be in for a great game here. Hopefully, hopefully it embodies the spirit of Black Ops 1. Oh, and also a bit of news on the tail of this. It has been confirmed this game will be coming day one to Game Pass. And so honestly, it doesn't really matter whether I'm hyped up for it or not. I'm going to be playing it. Not just because I play a lot of Call of Duty, but because why wouldn't I? I have Game Pass. Uh, so that's absolutely fantastic news. I actually got a notification through on my phone saying, oh, hey, check it out, Alan. Yes, this will be on Game Pass day one. So that is pretty sweet. Uh, but yeah, Black Ops 6, awesome teaser. Check it out with the audio because it's, uh, it's a great atmosphere. Um, and that's about it. So I'll see you all in, uh, for another video i guess that's what's going to be here the playstation is only 149 dollars and you can also get leading titles